Yo, what's up, YouTube? It's your boy Trippy for Life. Um, basically, I wanna I wanna attack the the rumors of the Superman Batman movie that's coming out here soon. A um, <clears throat> lot of rumors going around that who's gonna be in it. it went from Denzel Washington to Joaquin Phoenix. Um, none of them are in it as of as of yet. Um, Jesse Eisenberg is playing Lex Luthor. Don't know how to feel about that, but let's see what happens. Um, of course, Henry Cavill is Superman. You've got Ben Affleck dying Batman. Cowl for the first time. If they would hurry up and release some stuff about that, that would be great. Um, Gal Gadot is playing Wonder Woman. I don't care what anybody says. Everybody's always giving the girl hell. Yeah, she's small and whatever, but... She's absolutely adorable, so I'm pretty sure that she's going to do the Wonder Woman justice. I mean, she's even stated in, in interviews that it could be, you know, they, they talked about her, her breast size or whatever, and they, she was like, it's nothing that some money can't fix. So apparently she's dedicated to the part, and that's really cool. Um, but she is definitely signed on for three roles. There's going to be this one, the Superman Batman movie, Wonder Woman, and of course Justice League, which we all believe that they're filming back to back with the Superman 2 movie titled Batman vs. Superman as of yet. Um, <clears throat> but I don't know where this is going with this, um, with this movie or not. I don't know if it's going to be good. I'm thinking it's going to be outstanding, and it's going to blast the comic book movie genre to the, the whole, a whole other level. Um, if you guys are Arrow fans, you know, Arrow on the CW, which is tonight at 8 o'clock. There you go, Steven. I, I gave you a pop, bro. I gave you a prop. Um, <clears throat> if you're not watching Arrow, you guys should be watching Arrow because they're talking about making the DC TV universe clash up with the DC movie universe, which we could see Stephen Amell playing Arrow um, in the movies, which would be amazing, because I would never want to see anybody else but him play Arrow, because he does such a great job. Um, <clears throat> they've already released numerous characters on Arrow from the DC universe. There's at least, at least nine characters they've released, from Black Canary to Deadshot to Deathstroke. Those could all wind up being in the Justice League movie. Um, they also just released <coughs> uh, Suicide Squad, which is something cool to watch there. Um, what they're doing with that, that could be a really big villain uh, turnout for the DC Universe. Um, also, in the Marvel Universe, uh, Netflix has signed on to do over 100 <coughs> to 200 episodes on Netflix, random uh, from like Luke Cage to the Secret Defenders, um, Daredevil, stuff like that. But it's gonna be like they're gonna, they're gonna be hour long show, so it's gonna be good. They're gonna, they're bumping up their thing. They're gonna try to get their TV universe into their Marvel universe, into the Marvel Cinematic Universe too, which is actually really cool. Don't know what to think about Michael Douglas playing Hank Pym. That's a little bit of an odd thing. Not gonna lie, but. I guess they have visions, and when you have visions, you go with the visions. So apparently that was his vision to have him playing Hank Pym and Paul Rudd to play Ant-Man. So anyway, um, with that said, um, DC side, Marvel side, I really could care less. I just want to see the movies. I think they're going to be great. It's great to have them in more comic book movies a lot more comic book movies than just other movies because it's where the money's at, it's where the fan base is at. There's a huge fan base, huge following. If they would just listen to us, stop doing what you guys want to do. You cannot make the Human Torch African American. It's never, ever happened. Why? I don't understand. Where, are you, where were you going with that? Did you think that they, maybe, maybe he's a Adopted or something that would take the entire logic from the mo from the comic book and put it in basically your own made movie. That's retarded. I don't like that at all. Anyway, moving on now that I've voiced my opinion about the uh, Fantastic Four reboot. Um, not a fan of it. Am I a fan of the next Spider-Man movie? Yeah. 
Am I a fan of the Billy Idol wannabe frigging uh, Green Goblin? No. No, I'm not. He's terrible. I hate him. He's, uh, he looks like a jackal. And it scares me. I don't like it. And it makes me angry. As you can see in the background, I know you guys have been noticing this terribleness right here going on. See all that? It's all what happens when you do Adderall and smoke and don't finish painting. Isn't that fun? Soon to come, more paint jobs. Um, so let's move on to gaming. Uh, my brother recently got the Thief game. It just came out yesterday. And I'll tell you, it's, I mean, it's whatever. I would much rather it be Titanfall or Destiny or anything else. But it's, I mean, it's really not that good. It's a slower game. It's okay, though. Um, I really haven't got into it. I'm only on, like, the, s the six, six level. So, yeah, yeah. Actually, I have got into it. It's a slow game. Yeah. Um, I believe Bethesda made it. But, again, they're probably putting all their focus on the new Elder Scrolls Online game that's coming out soon, which is going to be awesome. So, make sure you go out and get that. Um, I don't know. Gaming-wise, I'm definitely on, still on Battlefield 4. It's still a great game, even minus their stupid glitch that they just had, where it deranked us, then ranked us, then deranked us, then ranked us, then deranked us, and ranked us again. So that was fun. No, it wasn't. I was kidding, being sarcastic there. But uh, other than that, the games that I'm waiting for: Titanfall, Destiny, pretty much it, and Dying Light. Um, it looks really good. It looks really intense and fun to play. But uh, <coughs> you guys are up tonight go watch arrow it's an amazing show you guys just don't know what you're missing so that is it i will leave you with that that is my shit that i had on my mind to go ahead and get it off that's my daily vlog what the hell ever you want to say um so this is trippy for life signing out and uh talk to you guys later all right deuces y'all